se in central juma eni hua e wiase en hu bribia mu nimde e in central juma e hu hia yie pa e san se e bo omanfo no amane e fa emprempren sema e sisi a e hu ehia enso nie ma papa e nam in central fo so e ba e matema mu fo so en saka bi no e ye bebre ni sa so nti sa documentary yi mu no ye rehwe en fa so papa Ghana for the Dwana, Enya every multiple award winning Ghanaian journalist, Regina Asamoa, Nijume Debia Wade Ebaya, what to they say, the missing children. But I had a tie side documentary, ye echi NSA. The missing children are fit back, what went to you mo, Niasi si womo, and what would do us, I'd made ye a dear bread and mushy, a quaw would do now, or may mono, ye petty in your eddy. Na a beer was only a bedroom suko. E fa se abofrebi e yira ana mo awose wutu ana se de awose wo ye se owofo no ye ma wo hu me bana yira se owofo bi ka asem wo ye a sabre na remu no Nia e koso ni pedriem huna mani adwenim e na empo na tinka mu no wontumi fa ntutu bibia ho na emre e ko e ko na abofra ne yen hu no no awofo no entumi nya hwe biem sense wode wonani e beto emra ne so e ne wono mu a obetumi aye bibia fa ho ama wono e so enya ni daso se obehu won ba ne bio Ghana and Centrini Bakua, Fim Pim, you knew any drunk chrono emo 2019. You're born a basso said best female journalist. Regina Asamoa and I'm the missing children documentary you so at the end of the show and bread and bread and food when you were just saying that you were my girl and 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 you were Ya e mofra wonu wo oman yi mu e wose wonu mu nya se the United Nations Convention on the Right of the Child e tre no wonu benya ne sa pepepe Why any Regina Asamoa I am Regina Asamoa Currently I'm working as a news editor at Atenka Media Village precisely Atenka 104.7 FM and then Atenka TV in the Greater Accra region of Ghana I am also a documentary filmmaker, I'm a gender advocate or activist, and a media consultant. As a journalist, my duty is to tell the story. But what drives me as my passion is to tell the stories of the vulnerable in society, especially women and children. With my background in development communication, I know that as journalists, we don't have to just tell a story, but we have to tell a story that will make impact. And that is what I have been doing. In my 13 years of experience as a journalist, I have worked on so many stories and documentaries. And these documentaries have not only impacted lives, it has gone beyond just telling a story. It has also helped influence policies. And that is something I can pride myself in. As the reigning Ghana Journalist Association, female best journalist, I decided to pursue an investigation and tell the stories of missing children in our country. Missing children, an area that has received low or no attention by the media and also by state actors or the security agencies. The Missing Children, Jumedia, you know, say in a chassis. The Missing Children documentaries all started somewhere in April 2021 when I decided to go and do a documentary in the Ashaman community. Ashaman is in the greater Accra region of Ghana. It is one of the fastest growing communities in Greater Accra region. 
me could do a shama one more semi quiet story. A fa a year in Mofra, a city name, a war, a year slum communities no, a whole and a social welfare officer, a friend of Archibald Mensa. A tree margin sees to say the issue of missing children, a year idea a home will be brave. O catcher me say, De Biano, dear record, this a bofra aira. A bill hono one no obina will be no abofrano, and a odi promo, sabofrana aira. Partly because a shaman is a big community and has one of the biggest markets. Inti no obi dene baba hobi di jane nyo me vibra na emo frano aira. Inti otre maji ni se su ne hube hiya se I pursued that investigation aside looking at child protection issues in a shaman at slum communities. Omo omo fa bibri ayedi omo kugu ayi orphanages in a shaman. But omo to me intrisi ayi emo fa yi ebu si anfo. Ebi e di ten years oho. Ebi e di three years, four years, five years. Na ushe emo fra o maka orphanages because Yehu or Mao for me, ya or Pepanese mediatory. Now, my investigating to know what is the gap that is not helping us find the parents of these missing children. A idea, Ura Archibald Mensa, edit to me name Effa issue of missing children in Ashamano. A hammy be brave, a son, Samia Casano. A idea, I was born and bred in Ashaman. In see, na issue of missing children, no matter. My year, Jumbo Ashaman as a journalist. And that issue about missing children, I minim kakra. But I minim say a two pointer every day a child goes missing in Ashaman. And so I decided to pursue a the missing children starting from a Ashaman municipality. No cranny says, I bofra a yira, a cha ayem shishie. If a child goes missing, it is not an easy moment or it puts the family in a dire situation, especially the parents. And to na a idea a happy brave. Uber Jane said, Ah, now Bofan is to say, Oh, him far. A Bofan we did day, a day na or Oshe, and you might be brain, I would Jane, I would for be crowd to me be some who say, A day na man yen a yen a man may ban a year, I will be a whole no more say, Ah, and come in him poor, Nanka may ban a cohano, Nanka me dinichi, because a Bofan you are, and yet a Sam Ketua. You might be brain, it's me ba, and my Abofra you are, you are a more frana genuinely, or could be be on him quino. And a wire, and you were more fra or musha that a Johnny Fifi. No more Johnny Fifi is an amo barbon thing. They come face to face with the relative was sent a bontonetia. They don't know even how to go back. Or money nam sa, they loiter, na afide, or maqua coyera. In most cases, no, what children run away from are adults who are either abusing them or adults who are not taking proper care of those children. These are some of the instances, sir. Emma Abofra. It's me, a era. Say about fry, era. If you were home, money, I say, eh, about funny, about fra bonny, or no, no, peso, Johnny Fifi, and I saw a babetuno. If you were home, ma, not about funny, a colla bonny, but then a marble funny, a colla bonny. His son say, near a wassail or sharp of funny tin and more sharp of funnel, one shiny ye. It is saying, more fry, a Johnny Fifi, a be a home, ma, not any na, if I some bono. Embo a year in Mofrano. Now, missing children documentary Nini Nano, Miguso Etremo Senior, a buyer me a documentary no. Now, Mr. Archibald Mensa, a buame, a diminim, a mamico, a year save them young orphanage, a war a shaman. Now, me could do honor, me rare who ye, a son semi who in Mofra over thirty year. Now, ye see Mofra when ye nigh your Mofra or my era. A more fry out try see a bin home, maybe see a fire home or maybe see a four. A more form more home, a be a day ten years, fourteen years, twelve years, nine years. A war home or more a son say social welfare officers na aye no me a piano. Omo to me home a year, a more free. Tress say a more far away or more destinies. Their destinies are trapped in these orphanages because they could not provide the basic details, sir. A bit to me a boy, a Tracy, a year or more family. Me who in Mofrane Sano, now Opepa as journalist, no. I may hear stories Danny Danny in my 13 years of practice, no. Na I bet she me muse was semi ye be de bois a year more I just don't have to tell the story of those children, but tell the story of those children so that I can influence their lives, help change their destinies, redirect the focus of those children because children's destinies cannot be trapped in orphanages. As I battle to think about how to do this documentary, how to tell the stories of those children, just so you know, I was emotionally drained. In fact, I actually got sick that I had to necessarily take a break 
from the whole documentary to be able to come back to myself and do my best to help those children because it's not easy and you would bear with me to look and meet over 30 children missing children some 14 years 13 years that are trapped in orphanages so i decided to do this after i recovered from my emotional shock of seeing these children i started working endlessly on this documentary with my award-winning visual editor robert tete we started working on this documentary sharing ideas on how to go about it so on the eve of 18th may 2021 our first promo video of the missing children documentary hits the screen of atinka tv now yeah 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 promo no my echo tv so tuesday in numeray 18th may 2021 and the best channel, which was the 19th of May 2021, now it will be every a year Eastern region. Abase, Omo 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 Ba, a war a year promo video now me boy you know. Now the next year me debut brain is say it will be any ba you know. Omo Ba no Omo Chia yes say Omo 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 me promo video no. That child was a special child. Oye Abofra sebi unto me en kasa sebi Oye Abofra Oye Moke and a it will be any extra channel. It was such a shame on our Bofana year for months. No more who be able for you all. Miss someone who knew you, Mira, it was Yanni a buyer. It is from a year eighteenth May twenty twenty one in your Mirena, ye ye, a year promo near the two TV sonum. Before twenty second May twenty twenty one, I ye be premier documentary in your anno. Now it was your best send me and son, and I'll bam in him. Say, promo now on who TV sonum. We had not even showed the documentary yet, but three families came and their traumatic experiences just made me know that we would have to do more in helping children who are missing be able to reunite them with their families. Three years near a son be pray. First in India, me a be a contrary me for one casa, a bedroom may require a crumb granam into me. Because Miss Yes, say me one a year mini and a banner, and I'm in a coji schedule, and I'm crofons to say, and yam me and me banty, and I'm a janaman. I am one a mini and a friend, say, Near say, you're caught on for under a gist schedule. Now, Miss Oki, Yamin, Yamin, and me, I ain't seen all chains as can you buy a bemani beard. They're just every ammy one with your man funny easy. My family, my nyani is a crime. My nyani is an abusian so dear. Me papa dear or say me nyabu train ya me beye. Now no cry a cobe be almost see we room and me catch a mam say back send us who cross some more jani kasa. A bedroom re be namin comi crum crabe se wan yan with dear namin co cra because ye be sami a mi hu anu yena nye obi bedroom so no ayen sembe bre. Debi a co squa. On one and antico. On one and so on one a beefy. O co school, a bobby five thirty six no. None of a daho. Now, my friend of a sir, a clan, O co school, fitan upon Omba, and so many and call Madame Nifi. Now, Madame Nifi no so bay. And see, you call Madame Nifi in a co beside. And see, Madame Nifre, eh, other Madame no school, a beside or since or the books. And a bag, and money, so on Fendi can brief you. By still, your china on back. Me tin pie bow, baby, me cock. Me call almost all ho, or ho, or a banner, say, own to me, Cassa, only baby, a woof you or beboa, drive a wood crab at the neighbor back. And I said, own to me, can't you be say, so what could you be in some ground to me, Cassa, if you could fold your scassu? Own to me, can't you ever can say, be a cocodia, cocodia. Me, 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 or know your social welfare officer at the Ashaman municipality. On your municipal head, Sassan Yetun Safra, a young penny for a mother, a save them young children's home. Honomo, 
where they put smiles on the faces of children. Yet so in Sashomu, Emma Omobe Pensin Pensemu, Emma Yehu, ye car issues of missing children were gonna hand more, and then the issues of missing children were gonna hand more. Documentary a decaya, a farm of fra, wire a hono, a bar mountainous way chino, a day in a free mobile. The outcome was mind blowing, overwhelming, explosive. I can go on and on and on and on because na a bro adrenaline as yet so. Near your documentary, we and a busier bar office on a more. Be brave into a ma, a year now watching a D kind of a year from Monday, no, after the premiering of the documentary from 24th of May 2021. I decided to say a busier banning in anno, meet ye or your own massem, a banner send on Mobane Raye, a day no my year edition shot on Mobano, no more Mobano with TV so no, a year almost saying, not in commodity in anno, not a yare who. Nebi a film. Obi o honu mo e busi ane se o de abofano akwa kodi sikedu. Obi o honu mo wakwa koda jail. Abofa ba ako ni family no mo se o mo se stand ne de abofani pe wakwa koda jail for about eight months because yes o no na oni nebi a kona no ne waira akwa koshi. Aside no no e busi e bi chere me se o mo kuhu e asofu o di fo e prophets fo ni bi ama ya mo mo nyoma se o mo koye akwa nche bi bre. Omo a modi handkerchief white. Eko jina krotia. Eko wosu wosu ya kanchi ma ya sa moba beba the next three days. Enu so me hun. E bin mo ko eye abosu mo so ko frere omo manu hun hun. E shoshe bebi omo manu wo. E bin so mo chua kwa inko Togo. E bin so mo chua kwa inko Benin. E bin mo se omo tu kwa in. Eko bebi bebre ni ni nana mo te shon omo manu. Na e bin mo so e. Omo se ni ni nana ye empaibo. So these are the traumatic experiences parents went through when their children went missing. So how did they receive the news? For them, how was it when they found their child on the missing children documentary that was premiered on the 22nd of May 2021? I was my channel I my channel I was okay. I I I I I and all their stories made me realize that as a journalist I have to continue to do works that will influence society to do more journalistic works that will influence policies and have direct impact on the lives of the people the stories revolve around in all this I realized one thing that some of the families that came did not actually see their children in my documentary. But they came to see me with the hope that I have to find their children for them. For some of them, they came to plead that can I continue my documentaries? Probably in my next documentary on missing children, they would find their children. Even with the 30, Nana, AM, AM, Shishem, Mamma, say, Me whom call 30, I need to find their families. No. Here is the case I had close to 10 families coming within a week to tell me that, can I please continue this and look for their children because they didn't find their child in my documentary? It became a challenge I had to pursue. But to make sure that those who have found their children in my documentary are able to go through the process and find their children, I decided to start and continue the journey. It has been an eventful journey since May 2021 till date because I have helped so many families to be able to find their children. Those who found their children, I helped to start what we call the reunification process for them by taking them to the social welfare office where they would have to go through some documentation. Then the children at the orphanages also had to go through some counseling so that they psych them and let them know that now we have found your parents. After 10 years, 
after 14 years, after three years, after two years, we have found your parents. How will these children welcome the news? That is what we call the reunification process and the reintegration process. For those who found their children in my documentary, I facilitated the process for them, for them to be able to take their children back home. I had a more for winning in Anna, I started to send me more with the reunification process. No, I share a year this journey we are marking and I say the documentary so far. My year above from why you're a child of a nature, Mary 19 and not above from why you're for 14 years or you're I know who age three and now you're for 14 years. That is the highest years of a child. Why you're a met me a reunited through by missing children documentaries and the above from not only crime was an eight months. Old baby, ah, or you're a mabo, my reunite me, you know, be pure or war, Nipano, or you are Bofrano, yet to me, Tracy, ye, and my to me, Eco, who ye, ye reunite, a demand, a ye, a busian, and tonight I was say, me go so a boa, because I had a lot of families coming to me, or me, one woman, or documentary, I have to help reunite, and I'm not missa, I want more, I mean, one more, me boa, a ye, a ye reunification. Every some missing children to media ye, a chassino, a nipa by ye say, a hen nine. And now, missing children team no one sa a can report a chess a one a yura na a mufa kesien na and a ye a mufra report a wobe ye no police report and a mufra wa yura no enfuni a kahon na we a chess a a wofwa won ma yura no etia yem shishi a mupa a wome imuno sabu frebi a yura be a ye di kaya wobeko a ya posi for a sue ye. Penny Quantra for our da missing persons unit, ye no a criminal investigations department, our police headquarters and was say, Chief Superintendent, Comfort, Entry, and so in some way at Suja. The missing persons unit is an investigative unit which was opened by the police administration to conduct in depth investigations into missing person cases. It was realized that much attention was not being given to this type of cases. So they realized that when the unit is open and dedicated to those cases alone, much attention will be given onto it. We are situated at the CID headquarters within the DOFSU unit, that is Domestic and Victim Support Unit, on the first floor. Our offices are located there. So if anybody wants to file a case, the person can just walk in and then report a case. It can also be that the person is not living within the area or within the jurisdiction. The person can file or lodge his or her complaint at wherever he is and an extract of occurrence can be given to the person and the person will bring it to our outfit and will continue the investigations from there. What we can tell parents and guidance are that, especially with children, they should try and have that cordial relationship with their children and have a lot of chat with them. So that in the first place, every parent or guardian should be able to let his or her daughter know their phone numbers. They should memorize it offhand. So that in case of anything, they can just give these numbers out and we can trace and then relocate their parents. They should be able to let the children know about certain things that are within their areas where they live. Maybe they can earmark an important place within the area so that in case they go missing and when they are found, they can help us with that to locate their houses. Parents should also have secret codes with their children, codes that can help them know that this is my, my parent speaking, this is my guardian who is speaking, or this is somebody that I'm living with that is talking. So that it, in case they go to school and somebody wants to pick them up without that code, they'll be able to reject that person and then they can find their way home if they are missing. When you work to our fate, we'll always be ready to help you. But what we will plead with the public to do for us is that any time we get to them and we are looking for information, they should be able to help us by divulging important information to us so that it will help us in our investigations. Plan International Ghana, a ye ankran kwe jume kwa, en sha bayase, e kwe yi e kuma e mufra fan hudiye, en empo se wobe nya pepe pe yo, e diyama e maya. Country Director, en e Solomon tes for Mariam, wache na jen e fa e mufra wano e yra yra, e wome yi mohon. It's clear that quite a number of children are basically missing. They are lost from their homes. 
And that is the primary responsibility of their families, to ensure that they are well protected and that they are within the vicinity and the protection of their own families. But there are cases where children are missing. And they're missing Ghana in a far more stable environment. Globally, children are missed in connection with civil wars, conflict, natural disaster, which is not the case in the case of Ghana. So we have a totally different kind of situation and condition attached to an increasing number of missing children. Say and missing children are feedback to you know a corner. It has been one success story after the other. Confidently, I can say that I have premiered three major documentaries on missing children. Abra Maya follow Abibre Afahu I serialize some of the documentaries as in the reintegration process ni nano. Yes serialize ya yedi akaho. In these three main documentaries, in our Mayano, na me ye do dona if you greater Accra region and a central region of Ghana. In these two regions, I focused on nine orphanages in greater Accra and in central region. And these nine orphanages have helped a lot so that I can also confidently say that through my missing children documentaries, I have reunited over 170 missing children in Ghana. I have three main documentaries here. Meet to me, I know. I bought my emofra over 170. And the young woman, and the mother of my busiya, 170 in the mono. Now a bin the mono, my impenny for. It's as if my bro, I have 18 years. But now, now I come home. A bin the mono, my ira, I know. No money in the 18 years here. But along the line, no, I must be the 18 years. I must come home. Meet to me, bought my impenny for. Say be the main shanty. Sebi o ni ninti na o tumi hu ne ekwan kofie ne waye rano o mu nyina enna me documentary we so ye hu omo ama e de enije aba eye ebusie mu asan se ye hu eye omo a omayira ye de ma ebusie ano ye tumi ebo aye ama me tumi aka se cases over 400 and abba menim sa cases we ni nyina no police extract kan ho e che se omo de hye ayira inti out of the missing children na me ye ye no ye nya platform where ye tumi e ma obi an de hye ayira no o contact e ye missing children team ni ye tumi e de chere ni ye de chere a nko fo friend e bo a connect ye ni ye tumi hu e ye omo loved ones we e de amomo aside 117 missing children and adults ye tumi re 92 I am missing children documentaries. No, I had many two dedicated phone lines. Ah, maybe here I am missing children to me day. So wherever you are in our country, Ghana, Oba Ayira, and now you have lead to a child who is missing, who has been kept somewhere, or you have contact to families whose children are missing, wherever they are, you just need to call us on these two numbers. When you call us, no, yeah, Joe, so, and we give you guidelines on how to go about it. That is something we are proud to say that it has also helped us to reach a lot of people in Ghana and outside Ghana to share with us issues of missing children. And I have created a Facebook page called Missing Children. And I'm sure we are all going to follow the page and we are all going to subscribe to our YouTube channel, also called The Missing Children. On our Facebook page, what we do is to give constant updates about Emofra or Mayera. When we find children who are missing, or I have leads to children who are missing, orphanages contact me and tell me where they have children who are missing. We post the pictures, hoping that we can help us to be able to reach the family. And that has been amazing because we've been able to connect families even through our Facebook page. Also, I must say, say from telephone numbers now, yeah, dear two Jana, yeah, boy, we unite missing children. We have received over hundreds, even close to thousands of calls from indigents, from Ghanaians, from other nationals whose children came to Ghana and got missing. The Missing Children Initiative has also received some recognitions by the Ghana Young Achievers Awards, by the Humanitarian Awards Global and also by the first African Media Awards. These are some recognitions that Ome Hunse, the Missing Children Jumeidini Edia Bagana, or the Missing Children Documentaries. No, It's a grey area no journalist in Ghana actually focused on. Another significant feat is that it has led to the creation of the Missing Persons Unit under the Criminal Investigations Department at the police headquarters. 
I'm excited about this because missing persons unit in Okaneno, Naoko police headquarters, there was no unit like that. And I remember a meeting where I had the opportunity to share with the IGP what the issue of missing children in Ghana since I started, what I have realized. And I remember very well he telling me that it is an area that they need to prioritize. And somewhere in 2022, through the police administration, top hierarchy, they decided to create a missing persons unit. And this is something I'm proud of. We have done some collaboration and I can say that they have helped us to reunite some missing children. And I'm very happy that through my missing children documentaries, this has become a reality. Similarly, me to me, I can say missing children documentary, you know, Abwa Ama, me to me, a for me, great partnership with well meaning Ghanaians, or more a chin in Mofrahu, a boss in Mofra Ayranum, a bit me a more Masan Kofi, now Mesa and Cassa police officers be be one more, and your Kofa Abeda Mini or more and Tem, or Mumu Abofra Wayra. The first thing is that they contact me. No, maybe some me say, Do you have this child? Family be about one more. Family be a Maya. J about funny details in the factory, not family in bra, intimidate or massy be brave. Such a social welfare officers be brave or honor mosa, or more by yemen now for four nessa, or munya a year about Fibia, why you rebia, or more fray, a mammy to me bois. Through my series, documentary series, we able to show those children to reunite them. Aside that, a owners of orphanages. I've built a relationship with some of them. Into almost said about far bro more. If the social welfare officer were on a name may contact her. Owners of the orphanages also try to contact me. Together we are able to start the tracing, contact tracing, to be able to find AF families. And other private individuals are they are interested in social welfare issues or child protection issues, almost so omabwa that we are able to contact some of the families. And when we hear Nyoma Kakra and Nyame Atom in this year long documentary I'm starting, you know, I have been able to do with the Missing Children Initiative. And who be here so man for a person so? Say Regina as someone, and yes, a war boa ama and more from one of my era. One who won't you cry, I could come a bush of four who uncle name mum or pim so cone name a pem moa, a sum of funny be a son in it through one more, a yam of bro or four any and young cafe a hoodwa. Some afraid to do an hour one more at Tiano. A young cafe a bakuasa, a yay dee be a so on so on. And I'm executive chairman, Emma Tobinko Group of Companies, Elder Nana Samuel Amo Tobin, the first SO, Emma Yedi, Enuyane, Sika, Eni, Enyema Hudwana, Eko, Eko Mawo. Ebiya Wosunu Gana Fuwa, Dudwana, Eni Adum Fuwa, Woneni Edi, Missing Children, Jumediye Yechin, So, Edi, Nyeme Biti, Se, Enta, Diye, Empabwa, Enwuma, Akadi, Amo, Fredi, Diya, Gro, Enuyane, any name of the bray, a bray regina, some one say one far, Emma and Yankafia, a share a mufre, you know. A mufrani beer, no one num, in here, I arish, and I send a one nippedium baby at Tetrama, never could hear say a don't be quiet, I resub be a more quiet, I arish, and so. Regina, some one, no one cassa, add in the bottom sicker, a share mufre be, I arish, a beer was so no, or hinny or war at TB a quo, ya was sans so a year jas a hene, and my quo at Nancunya, bury ma, come your santi beti and near what also me no. A bofra no when ya and fear do na wa yira ye, na and now missing children you made ye so, and me didn't sound common the bush and four, sebe na a bofra no na swan si. Bury ma, come your santi beti and near what also me no a boy ye, and my yoko ye no, sedry, a walk of Rudia government hospital, and no chino. Was sign so at the no aqua to school mu a walk of Oridia school for the deaf. A yano cosam say, One man such ragge, a bon man for brabo. A so dia o fato, or so, sir, Uber Buama Mofra, one of my yerra. When no one a bush here assigns so a cabomunum, a wakon to a muno, near my bain, sir, and a woo ya was so say, and no enna emma and mofra, a tie a yerra yerra, and I said mofra yerra yerra, a cosro pa, a woman. Parental control. Parental protection, parental guidance. I will for say, or more be or more bani ye no. Be brave. I will for no more ain't say or more and share a or more a ye. In pain piano, a jay a duty as parents. Edima will be such a me bama me meba. It's me ma abofra yera. Any yama be brave and cosso will fear. Emma abofra any ng will fear. It's my emofra jani fifi. And now I say, I'm a fire. 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 And now I say
and no eka ho etimi ma emofra no omo yera aside eno no ebusua ye do baby wo no ma in Ghana here it's like the extended family no longer have control over the children and even the immediate the society does not have control over the child as in correctional measures obi aye din she obi ba e bi nimo ye niomope e obi ani ni nko ne ma ho uno ba te ho in the community people within the community cry o nim we don't show our children what they have to know basic details about ourselves where we work the kind of work we do our telephone numbers all the things we don't show our children and these are some of the trainings parents would have to give to their children but we don't do and these are some of the gaps i have identified the other gap i also realize is lapses in the security systems because i realize that when a child goes missing and even if the child is found i have a case where the child who went missing the family went to a particular police station to go and report that my child is missing they gave the family a police extract they told the family to go and do an announcement as they also do their best to find the child interestingly enough it was the same police station that somebody spotted the child somewhere and brought the child to the police station what happened at the police station what happened was that a year nipa no di kan ehun abofane de ne ba ho no the officer o she an no it's not the same officer when the family got there they met and as at that time i don't know what kind of records they kept and so they couldn't reunite or connect the dots and that particular child in question actually spent 14 years in an orphanage until i reunited this child with the family and these are some of the gaps in the security system and i must say that it's actually affecting how we find children who are missing the other gap too is the institutions mandated to trace and find and connect children who are missing so social welfare is mandated to help in reunited children aside their numerous mandates what happens is that social welfare keeps the child in an orphanage and start the process but in instances where the child is not able to give social welfare the basic details what happens they keep the child at the orphanages i think that now the missing children initiative has started has created a, a platform or is an eye opener that wherever social welfare officers are that they have children that have been kept in orphanages they are unable to trace their family they can take advantage of the missing children initiative and bring the children forward for us to show similarly they can try and do other posters mount posters of those children at very vantage points where families or communities will be able to see those children and also most importantly the police are supposed to mount pictures of these children that are found and brought to them on a notice board similarly they can also show pictures of children that the families or when families come and report leave a picture we paste there at the notice board of the police station without us bridging these gaps it it will be extremely difficult to reunite children with their families when you name no kwai be so en ye be ka boom aye dwuma hwese e mo fra wonom e yira yira e ho nsem no e be ye hiasem na fensu ya hwese e mo fra fa ho dia e wose wonom enya wo mo fra bre mu no e hwere won kanin man panyin e ma oman yi his excellency john ajeb kumkufuo ene etitiri ne ni ntina hodo na so e chire won adwen this days we hear from the media a lot about missing people uh, in some instances such uh, missing persons have been abducted uh, for what purposes i can't really fathom uh, it's not always good but i'm here appealing also to the um, police in the first instance and to society generally that anywhere they see a suspicious situation of some some child in distress uh, in some wrong company they should report the situation quickly so uh, such uh, people in distress uh, will be given the necessary relief so they can be restored back home 
So uh, I would appeal by encouraging the social welfare authorities and then the missing children organizations to continue with their good work. Our children are just too important for us to say that it is this person's job, it is that person's job, it is everybody's job for us to keep our children safe. And so child protection is no longer just the issue of the parent, it's not just the issue of the school, it's not just the issue of the church, not the police, not other agencies. It is the duty of all of us as a nation. And happily, it is us who work in all these institutions. You know, it's us who work in these institutions. So if we see it as a shared responsibility, then I think we'll be able to minimize it a lot. I mean, I cannot imagine how a child gets reported to a police station and is sent away to an institution, an orphanage, for 14 years and we cannot trace that child. It is difficult to understand it. You see, the problem is that a lot of these missing children have never been to school. A lot of them don't even know the addresses of their homes and things simply because their parents are illiterate. So they also end up being illiterate. That's the starting point. Secondly, they really do not have even knowledge of their relations. So when they step out of the house and they get missing, they do not even have a clue to either go to somebody or even at the police station to say, I have an aunt who lives somewhere or there's the address or whatnot. Illiteracy is the cause of this. Yes, our communities can help. For example, in times past, in a village or in a community, if my child is doing something that is not good, a house nearby, even three houses away, can call me and say, we saw your child doing this or this, or can even question my child and try to straighten my child. But now that is not done. Yes, social welfare is an institution that has a role to play. But I'm sure if we went to talk to them, they'll talk about how under-resourced they are. They'll talk about how even their mandate is not clear and so on. For example, if a child is found in the streets and the child cannot mention their address, there's nothing social welfare can do, except to get a TV station to feature the child and hopefully somebody will see it. So again, there's a lot of education that needs to go out for even the parents to know that the least you can teach your children is the address of where they are and a name or two of a friend or a relation that in case they get missing, they can go. At worst, the child should know a landmark around their house. Because when you get to that landmark, most children will be able to point their houses. The police has a role to play because the police are in every village, even the smallest villages. The police can also help in also educating. The police is not only there to enforce rules, the police can also educate. So, to sum it all up, I'll say that education is the major tool that both the community, the institutions can engage in. Our strong recommendation from Plan International is that the police as an institution should put very strong framework to record all cases and to collaborate with the social services so that the children are actually housed in a very protected environment where they can basically have basic services like health and education because what happens to quite a number of missing children is that they are actually denied the opportunity to be educated and that has significant consequence on the nation when you look at it from a bigger extent but we also live in a digitalized world and it's a major priority for Ghana in terms of really using digital systems to record a number of issues, a number of data. So when it comes to children who are missing, 
currently it's all all written reports but our recommendation is to use the digital world so that they can take pictures and those pictures can basically be sent to all police stations so that it can assist parents as they are looking for the children at national level and that is really our strong recommendation but we are also asking government to do more especially to support the orphanages so that the orphanages as institutions can be well supported financially and technically in order for them to prioritize the identification of families but the protection of children as long as they stay in these orphanages. That is really our cry and humble request to our government. Mensi mu penyini pa wada social welfare aswe ya ewo a shaman orua akchibaud mensa eni wo nipa wo di kanya e si ni so e ma mensim children jumedie you know e shasye wo niyan chuchu nkomo e fa kwanya jumedie yi e dia brewon se social workers. We really appreciate uh, what missing children have done to us in the this past century. Looking at where we were before Brianna came to me and where we are now. Before, we had a lot of missing children coming to Ashama Minispa as a special effort of to be precise. And if you interview them, they refuse to talk. So you have nowhere to send them than to put them in the orphanage room. But when Brianna came to, into our office, a different program I introduced the issue to her and really she did help us. I remember the very first time we went to the orphanage home, the city there young home. A lot of children there. But when we did the preview of the children over there, the, 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 a lot of parents came for their for their children and it was very successful. Up to now we don't have any background of children at the home that I would say is a problem to us. And it has gone a long way to help us. Any moment you have a missing child, you we'll just take a picture, send to Rihanna, and the next day the children will come out. And then we will do a reintegration. We have done a lot of reintegration with Rihanna. I can't use it so much, so much. We really benefited from that particular program. And we, we wish her good in whatever she does. And uh, we, we are praying that. This program will continue, and then other children in other homes through this program we able to locate their parents and reunite them to their families. Uh, on behalf of all social workers in the country, because this program has been to Central Region, Greater Accra, Eastern Region, and through this program, parents were able to see their children at times for 10 years, more than 10 years. Our prayer is that we will get sponsorship for this program, that we will be able to continue to work things out for parents who have lost their children, they don't know where they are, but through this medium, they've been able to uh, read their children for the first time for 10 years, 20 years, and the rest. Now, I will follow you in the world, and you will join us in the world, and you will join us in the world, when the Nijie and when Jidia will walk at one central Jumanimono, a cost three year pa. This is a proper work in Ghana. <laughs> I, I'm in every semu because I've gone through a lot. Ma kum, and here is it. So we babayira for one year, two years, three years. 
Now even one week cry, eh, baby, or what is here? Are you safe, mommy? Oh, sister Jana, sister Jana, my mummy bow. Six years, seven years, and yet is a young day for cry. Or bat him be a yammy parin and any by friend in same. Never could do by this our own, but I Nana, <laughs> 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 Sa wushe enfasua, mesen chude njume diye yi, edia bre o manfua, sayi ena tenkane tiye. Oh my goodness, I feel fulfilled. Mini aji, say, mesen chude ndokumentu na medibaya no, inya yusin san so be bre, positive ones, abwa ama enije abba ebusi emu, Abwa mankofu ati ni emma ana ni ebit mi ama omoma ayira. Abwa mankofu aye ashe ye ewa omoma hon. Abwa ama odra ebi mpu nyama omoma na ebit mwa omoma ni jane no. Oma sakra oma kwe imu. Abwa ama emo fra bibri ananka oma ka ofa ni jesina omo destiny si ni mse ni ebe yeno. Abwa ama sese yeno oma befie. Eco school, e enjoy omo rights as children. They are enjoying their childhood days. Ama mi hun se, e ye journalism as a professional. It is one of the greatest weapons na ye bitu mili impact the society positively. Na missing children documentary way. It is a living testimony. Na ebu suya, uwa ye mshishim. Na wo shwa kwa yin se, ube hun wuba. Uwa se e ni da suwa no. Ye wun kwa yin shen se mi yi, e fri ya titiru nye niti nun penye fwa hu duwa na ho. E de ma se, some people think that trauma is just maybe you got an accident or your child has died or husband died. Trauma is anything that shakes you. And a missing child can be so traumatic that it can even lead to the death of a sibling or a parent. Because every day you hope that they will find their child. As the years go by, you're not sure whether to give up or to continue. So, so, so it is not a very comfortable place to find yourself. Don't blame yourself too much, even if the problem was because of your negligence. Just dwelling on the mistake is not going to help. Begin to see things from a positive point of view and work hard to make sure that whatever mistake was made will be corrected and that you will be reunited with your child. Worrying about, and I made a mistake, and I'll never forgive myself, is, is not going to solve the problem. It's not going to solve the problem. Let's look ahead, and let's see what we can do. Uh, also to the families, the parents, immediately your children leave home, and you can't trace them, please do not hesitate rush to the nearest police station and lodge a complaint. And then, if possible, also go to some FM station and report so the entire uh, society will be made aware uh, with the description of the missing children. So when they are spotted anywhere, they will be held back to you. But I would also add the general public that when you see uh, children who appear distressed, and especially in companies that do not look natural, I would urge that you report to the police to stop uh, possible wrongdoing uh, against such uh, children. Uh, it's important we, we help 
to stabilize our society uh, in these dif difficult times to protect the children. Na emufra bebru wo hani edu your song over 170 children. A se se ni wani wana bushinya. A sa yisu akabu mu biye wuno. Ye ni mo se. Mumufra bre mufra hudiye eni eni jia. E wase mu nyano. Mu nyane sa pepe epe. Na emufra wano ma yira na emprim prim. Wako pye mu ewo enyan kafiye nenso. Nya yesha mu ene se. I'll say to them that they should not lose hope. They should keep trusting and believing that this initiative is going to do all it can to link them with their parents. And I'll also say to them that just like the other children have been reunited, they will also be reunited. And while they are waiting, apart from not losing hope, they should also make sure that they are truthful, they are well behaved, and they are making the lives of those who are catering for them not difficult in terms of cooperating with them. And those who have even the slightest idea of where they live must not hold it back. They should actually give their clues. Any clue is better than no clue at all. To the children who are grown enough to know that they are missing and uh, will be able to identify their parents or family members, uh, what I want to say is, wherever you are, kindly report to the police. Uh, so the police will take over a link with the social welfare organization and then with the missing children's uh, organizations. So they would help you to go back quickly home. Children, all of us love you. Even the parents you have been separated from. I can assure you that children, your mother, your father, your aunties, your grandparents, they are worried about you and they wish you can be reunited with them. Take full advantage of where you are. It is true, it's not like your home, but see it from a positive point of view. You have food to eat even if it is not the food you're looking for. You have clothes to wear even if you wish it were different. You're going to school. Take advantage of these, embrace them, and look forward to the day when you will be reunited. And yet, the crosser will be a beshe cassier, and as we're back in kind and send be another documentaries beer. At this say, Nelson no one who or how wa send training no effermo, so a bay be beer at this, sir. So a better story, a dana quemu, a yepe pepe, and tranche beer nim. Not me for so any and fast war at the frisso. A how would do a bay now fair monsieur and same training a fair back could near would he said you made your way a sea when so. If I'm to recount the challenges, um, they are enormous um, challenges from financial challenges, physical challenges, spiritual challenges, psychological challenges that I go through. Or how an hour consider be brave or a juma me ye mo, me yano smooth sa physical, a be any logistics. Only me bay from May 2021 up to a Maria Meno air casino. It will not be easy to transport yourself from one location to the other. Meno air say the missing children initiative, no. Currently, I don't have any headline sponsor, and I say me ni will be an edge me could be or be a what my production cost hoka. In most cases, I would have to foot the bills myself. Now I was saying, making sure say, me name team, you know, we are able to get to location. Me name team, you know, we are able to do what we are supposed to do to help families. We know reunification is not just a day. Although you just see us capturing the day where we take the child to the house and everything, there are lots of background works we have to do, and the cost that comes with it. It's mind blowing, but in more cases, we would have to bear the cost ourselves. Logistics. Currently, I do not have a vehicle that I can say I am using for all my production works. And so sometimes I have to fall on friends to give me their vehicles to be able to go to location and be able to do a production, especially in areas where they are remote or the road is bad and all that. I have to fall on some friends to help me. So the production cost is actually weighing 
What is keeping me going is the fact that I'm impacting lives. Let me put on record that in all this over 170 missing children we have reunited and the others we are yet to reunite, the others we show on our screen, I have not, neither has Atinka TV charged any family to pay any money for the services through my missing children documentary we have rendered. No family has paid any money to us and I do not charge any family to pay money. However, I would appreciate if after watching this documentary we'll have sponsors coming on board, individuals to support, take care of the production costs so we will be able to move beyond Greater Accra and Central Region. As I speak with you, I have reliable information of orphanages where we have missing children there. They need me to move just beyond Greater Accra to the Ashanti region of Ghana, to the northern region of Ghana, to help them, connect to them, so they find the relatives of these missing children. But I'm constrained by logistics, and so I'm not able to move to go around. In terms of spiritual, we are all spiritual beings, and I know you would appreciate. Now, only me be ya agent say, as spiritual beings there, ye ye but say abofra be yira, na ye hunu wo be bia na ye hwehwe na ye hwehwe na ye hunu ebi no ho mo fa na yira ye no jidie na ete eche no se ebi wo ho no mo a efifie ebi wo no ye hunhun bi ebi wo ye we ntin e ba ne sa na na wo a wo di enim se wo pese wo bua ma e mo fe isa be fie no then the attack is coming on you na me fa kwan we so would want to thank all my christian friends my family especially and all the pastors who call and support me with prayers to be able to do this. Um, thank you very much. Attacks need a be about, but we have been able to survive it. Now let's talk about the psychological trauma I go through. Just imagine, say, what a, now when you call, your phone is ringing, oh fire. Now, obi be a sumo phone, say, madam, me power cho, boa me, so open, I'll be to me, I'll be to me, I'll be to me, I'll be to me, I'll be to A desperate parent calls, sometimes around 3 a.m. And, I'm tempted to pick because that is a dedicated line, a media tool for missing children. And I picked one of the calls at dawn and the woman was crying, begging I should help. Psychologically, it's even traumatizing for me knowing that someone is trusting or hoping in that I can, through my investigations, find her missing child. It is traumatizing. These are some of the challenges I go through and I'm trusting that as you watch me, as I recount my journey in the missing children, you'll be motivated to support me in this course, to be able to do this, help reunite children with their families, thereby limiting the challenges I also go through in terms of financial challenges, in terms of psychological challenges, in terms of spiritual challenges. I'll be able to survive this, to be able to do the work I am doing to help reunite missing children with their families. And when you focus, you will find your partner and your piano. We are not about to burn some beer. A friend, when you focus, I hold on and I want to say a very big thank you to the missing children team for the good work they've done, for the smiles they've put on faces, for helping us reunify missing children with their families, and giving these children happiness enjoy in life because some of the children at the homes are not happy they are there if you talk to them one on one they'll tell you they want to go home and we thank god for giving this team this kind of vision to support us do it in a way that um, has seen an increase in the number of children who have left children's homes God bless you. May you receive more resources to help Mother Ghana find families for missing children. They are vulnerable children. They are confused. They don't understand the world because they know that they came from somewhere. And they don't know why they are at a different place and they don't understand why they are not seeing their family members anymore. They ask themselves where their relatives are, their siblings, their parents. So as we've seen the evidence on TV, 
the joy and happiness that reunites them is tremendous. And we are so grateful for the good work you've done for Mother Ghana and especially for Department of Social Welfare and Minister of Gender, Children and Social Protection. May the Lord guide you and provide all your needs. As you work for these vulnerable children, may God also bless you. For Bible says that if you water, you yourself will be watered. I would like to thank you personally and your team for the significant commitment that you've shown in addressing gender-based violence against girls. I would like to commend you for the great work that you are doing. The greatest point in terms of this missing children and the ability for us to support them in protecting them is the integration and the reunification with their family. This is a good initiative. The Missing Children's Initiative is a laudable one. And I'm glad to say that I do associate with this initiative. And I hope that this initiative, as it celebrates the one year, will find other people to partner with on this journey. And I also pray that this initiative will continue to go on. And therefore, I'm looking out, finding ways of sustaining it, finding ways of whipping up enthusiasm and making sure that next year by this time, many more children will be united with their parents. So God bless the Missile Children Initiative. God bless you all. I would end my appeal by congratulating Ms. Regina Samoa the Missing Children team for the great initiative uh, they've taken to bring uh, children back to their families, to, to reunite them, to lessen the difficulties and stresses that society generally is afflicted with in these very difficult times uh, here in Ghana as well as many other places around the world. The UN Convention on the Rights of the Child and the Children's Act of Ghana nini na eka safa hiye hubi hiya se e mofra e ni beji wo mofra bremu na wo mfa hudiye so en firi wong na se o meyi ye hwe se Sustainable Development Goals ye bedru hono e huwa ko hiya si ye beka bom na e mofra wano mo e yura yura wo mfa hudiye e na empo si ye beshe wone hu wong Na yadi won asa koma ebusuano ye bema no aye ye hiasem